All right, what's up, y'all? So today's old school boxing lesson is going to be working on Teddy Nugent's cuff to uppercut. Now I'm going to go ahead and show you how we're going to go ahead and work on working on a cuff to a lead left, and how we're going to go ahead and counter that with an uppercut and also a body shot. So we're going to go ahead and add our own little spice to Teddy Nugent's old school cuff to uppercut. Now again, we're just going to go ahead and show you the left side. So taking it super slow, right? If we got somebody here. And I throw out my lead left. He's gonna cuff it as he cuffs it and pushes it to the side. What that's gonna do is that's gonna open me up for a nice uppercut. So what he's gonna do is he's gonna go ahead and throw that uppercut at my face. From this position here, if you look to his other side, I can't hit him, but yet he can hit me. So now with his right hand, he's gonna throw a hook and hit me right in my face, which nine times out of 10, most people are gonna grab their gloves so that they don't get punched in the face and they're gonna block their head. But now what does that leave us open with? The body. All the momentum of that right hand swing now is gonna give him massive power in that body shot and it's gonna let him go ahead and get out of position. So again, in a little bit faster motion, I throw a jab, he's gonna cuff it, uppercut, throw a hook, come down to that body shot. Now, if you pay attention to his right hand hook, he's not throwing a straight elbow hook. So his hook is not going here. That's a straight. He's throwing an old school upward elbow. So we're bringing it down. And what this is doing again, when he throws this thing around, his body is now torqued for that massive body shot. So again, working the cuff to uppercut to hook to body shots. All right, here we go. multiple times. It's a great little technique and it's a great counter against somebody's lead jab. It's going to go ahead and set you using that high low principle and again it's going to put him in a position where he's hitting me and I can't hit him. Again, cut, water cut, swing, body, get out of the way. So again he's in back of me and I'm still looking this way. Anyways, old school Eddie Nugent from the Marshall Stillman Method. Let us know what you think.